less than one eight. We've been practicing volume. Remember, you can count the boxes. We also know that volume equals length times width times height, or volume equals the area of the base times height, or we've even looked at the whole layer, whole bottom layer, and then how many layers it goes up. We'll take a look at it here. So it says, a fifth grade class raised money to buy math tools to send to, the, to other schools. Tom, Ed, and Anu are in charge of packing unit cubes. They want each student to receive a box with at least 100 cubes. Tom, Ed, and Anu started packing the boxes. They wonder if each box is big enough to hold at least 100 cubes. So the first one says Tom's box. How many cubes can Tom's box hold? So I see right here there are one, two, three, four boxes, cubes. Then back here I see one, two, three, four, five, six. So I right now I know four times six. So four times six equals twenty four. So I know my bottom is 24. Now I need to know how tall it is. So I'm looking at these cubes right here. 1, 2, 3, 4. So 24 times 4. 4 times 4 is 16. Carry my 1. 4 times 2 is 8 plus 1 is 96. So how many cubes can it hold? Will it hold at least 100? So it needs 100 cubes. No. Tom's box is not big enough. Ed's box. You want to count the cubes at the bottom, or remember, we can multiply width and length. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So, six times six is 36 and then so I have one layer plus one two so two plus one is three so you do the math here and figure out how many cubes and is Ed's box big enough at the bottom you have a news again I would take these two measurements multiply them so Three, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, three times seven. Then I know I have one full layer plus one, two, three, four is five. So three times seven times five. Practice. It says in per insert parentheses to make each equation true. So first things first, I need to know what 14 plus 2 is. That's 16. So I have to figure out how I can get my right side, this side, to equal 16. So... I'm going to do um, I do this first 3 times 2 is 6 6 plus 6 is 12 plus 2 is 14 that's not true so what about this Parentheses, 6 times 2 is 12, plus 6 is 6 is 18, so that doesn't work. But what about this? 6 times 2, 6 plus 2 is 8 times 3, so that's not true. Let's see, where did I make a mistake? Here, because I'm adding wrong. That's 5. 
five, t five times two then is 10, 10 plus six is 16. Then down at the bottom, a little tougher one, 128 plus 28 is 16, four, five, 156. So, let's see what 52 times 3 is. So you want to do this first and then multiply by 3. So do 5 and 6 on your own.